Today guys, I am going to be showing you how you can factory reset your iPhone. This is actually really critically important, specifically if you're looking to sell the device or looking to do some kind of part exchange or something like that. So let's get into it. Okay guys, so here I have my iPhone. The first thing we want to do is navigate over to settings, click on the settings gear there, and it's going to bring up all your settings for your iPhone. Okay, now there's a few things that we need to get straight straight away before we start deleting anything erasing or factory resetting the first thing we need to do is make sure that we actually do have a backup of all of our data that is on our phone here now to do this is via iCloud so we're going to scroll down okay until we find the iCloud option which is this one right here we're going to click on that then in this setting what we can do is we can scroll down until we find something that's called iCloud backup here you can see that mine happened 10 hours ago but we can go ahead and click on that and then in here, we can click on backup now if we need to, okay? So really, really important that we do that. Um, it's important that we do make sure that we have a backup of all of our data because that's how we're gonna restore all this data onto a new phone later down the line, okay? So if we want to basically look to upgrade to a new iPhone or just move over to a different device, backing up your data is gonna be really important. So we make sure that we do this before we do anything else, okay? The next thing that we need to do, if I come out of all of those settings, scroll all the way to the very top here, is we need to make sure that we're signed out of the iCloud and out of the Find My Applications. Now, the easiest way to do this is to click into your name here, which is your account, your Apple account, scroll all the way to the bottom and then click sign out. Now, by signing out, you're going to sign out of iCloud and the Find My automatically. OK, so that's going to be the second thing that you need to do. First is back up your data. The second one is then sign out. Once you've signed out, you can then go ahead and scroll down to general from the general settings here. Scroll all the way to the very bottom where it says transfer or reset the iPhone. Click on that one. There are two options here at the bottom, reset or erase all content and settings. We would click on erase all content and the settings. In here, it's going to give you a bit of a warning sign, tell you the things that are gonna be deleted and make sure that they are removed safely from your phone, such as apps, data, your account, the Find My, the wallets, the eSIMs, all of that stuff. Now, I'm not gonna proceed any further from here because I do not want to actually erase my iPhone and all of my data. But basically, you would continue, you would ask you for your password, you put your password in, it would then go through the process of deleting and formatting the hard drives of the device, reinstalling the operating system and put you right back to the welcome screen like it was a brand new iPhone. And guys, that is it. That is exactly how you would go ahead and factory reset your iPhone. If you have found this useful and informative, then smash that like button for me, hit the subscribe and I will catch you all in the next one.